this one, we're gonna need some of that, which is distilled vinegar. You're gonna need some bicarbonate of soda. You're gonna need a piece of paper, doesn't need to be red or orange, anything you want it to be. You're gonna need a lighter or anything, matches, and a candle. Doesn't need to be scented like this one, just anything that makes a flame will do. And yeah, when you've got them, keep watching. Another thing that I forgot to mention is you'll need a pot, doesn't need to be like this, it can be a cup, a bowl, anything. And what you're going to do is you're going to get your vinegar, pour the vinegar into here, about half inch, down there. Then, put your bicarb, and this is it. When you put your bi bicarb in, it's going to react with the vinegar. So what you want to make sure is you have the piece of paper straight to hand, so that you can put the paper over the top to stop it overflowing. Before we do that, we we'll get the candle burning. There you go. Leave that burning away. We're getting rid of it. When you put this in, it's going to start going really bubbly. Just make sure you keep your paper ready to go straight over the top. You might have seen it bubbling through the side. Just keep it covered up and the silver bubbles start to sell. Just like now. You see? You don't need to worry about inhaling carbon dioxide. Just the same thing that comes out of a bottle of coke when you open it. When you've done that, then you get your candle. And because carbon dioxide is heavier than oxygen, it's going to stay inside the pot. So you want to get your candle, aim, I'm just going to get the position. You're going to pick up this, and without pouring any liquid, you're just going to pour the carbon monoxide onto the candle to put it out. Are you ready? Watch. There we go. No liquid come out that was purely put out with carbon dioxide, so yeah. Hope you had fun. Carbon dioxide isn't dangerous, so you don't need to panic. Yeah, that was it. Cheers.